What's up, guys? Uh, today, I want to go over uh, a, an important uh, feature of our snapshot that we've built in. So just like High Level offers a bunch of features, uh, we've actually built in uh, a feature that uh, that you can offer to your customers. Um, it's this little call widget uh, that could be placed on any website uh, or any landing page. Uh, it's good for any business that uh, wants their customers to call back um, or call them and want to capture the information. The whole purpose of High Level is to capture the information so you can nurture the clients uh, or the customers and, and get them to eventually buy from you, right, uh, from that particular business. So just like uh, the chat widget, right, in addition to the chat widget, you could have the callback widget as well or the request to callback widget. We've done it in a couple of ways, you know. So there's one, of course, the phone number is visible. If someone just wants to call, they can just click click here to call, or if they're on the mobile device, they just click the number and they call or the dialed number. Um, you know, talk to a specialist now. Uh, this opens up this the the uh, callback uh, request to callback uh, widget where you enter their your first name, last name, uh, mobile phone, uh, and email, and then you hit the request to callback. And we say, hey, we'll call you back immediately uh, within as little as 60 seconds. Um, and you can obviously change this timing to whatever you want. Uh, we just put 60 seconds as a, as a safeguard. Uh, because as, as we tested, every call was well within 60 seconds. Matter of fact, even 30 seconds. But um, it, it's good to just have it uh, have it there. But if you want to offer some sort of faster timing, um, you most definitely can. If it's uh, during business hours, uh, otherwise, uh, we'll call you back next business day. So perfect. If someone's you know looking at your website late at night or after hours, um, they can um, they can come in here, request a call, and they just know that they're going to get a call back uh, the next morning. Uh, the uh, the little widget right here, uh, the phone icon, does the same exact thing. Opens up the same exact uh, widget uh, uh, pop up. And uh, you were able to enter in your information and uh, request that call back. I've got uh, a little form that I've uh, already um, done this on. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, submit that uh, information. And then uh, there you go. It says, hey, uh, we're going to call you back uh, shortly. If you reach this after hours, please uh, expect a call next business day. And we're located at um, whatever all the information there, right? And uh, check this out. There's an outbound call uh, already being placed, uh, which is um, waiting uh, for me to answer. Um, uh, receiving the call right now, I'm not going to answer the call. But uh, uh, here's the message that just went out and uh, the name we entered in there was Sharon. So thank you for requesting a call back. We'll call you back shortly. Here's the number, uh, ABC Company. And in case you want to, you know, reach uh, reach back out, and we're also letting them which we're letting them know which number that they're going to be expecting a call, so that they can actually answer that call. Now, this call right here, the outbound call, is being placed to uh, an agent of the business, and when they receive the call, it's telling them, "Hey, uh, you know, Sharon from your website requested a call back." please uh, press one to connect with them right now. Um, so they'll press one, uh, the, the business, right? The agent of the business will press one to, uh, or any key for that fact, to connect to the to the person who's requesting the call. Then then it's gonna start ringing onto the, uh, the person who actually requested the call and uh, um, it'll ring, ring, ring. They answer, you connect. Um, if they don't answer, and automatically a text message will fire off saying, hey, um, this is so-and-so, we, we uh, attempted to call you, uh, would you uh, please give us a call back? Right. And then if you want, we can even set up a second call back uh, within uh, a, a few minutes uh, or so, uh, or half an hour later or something like that. Hey, you had requested a call back, uh, you weren't able to answer earlier, you know, press one to connect, whatever the case is. Um, they but uh, the point uh, here is that uh, you're able to provide another widget to your customers that makes receiving uh, calls and requesting calls for their customers even easier. A lot of people sometimes don't end up, you know, don't like to pick up the phone and wait through some of the uh, some of the IVR systems uh, that are in place. Right. Um, so they just want the business to call them and they want to talk to the person about something right away. So if, if that if that's the type of business um, that you are working with, uh, you can definitely offer this. Um, there's a wide use case of how many and what type of businesses can utilize this feature. Um, there's a bunch of different businesses that uh, that'd be happy using a request a callback feature. Matter of fact, 
there's a company called CallPage. Um, this is where we originally, uh, you know, tailored the, the uh, feature from, and they're charging people uh, 29 bucks a month uh, for up to 45 leads. So they consider every call request from your website or landing page a lead, and uh, they're uh, charging them 29 bucks a month. If you want to go up to 150 leads, that's 159 bucks a month, right? Um, so you can you can literally use this to compare with someone else and say, hey, look, um, you know, with with our software, it's either part of the package or it's you know uh, x amount of dollars extra, whatever it is. You can add that fee into your to your uh, recurring revenue and and earn an additional subscription off of it or um, make it a reason why why people buy your uh, subscription over piecing together from multiple different softwares and call page being one of them so but all right that's it for uh today hope you like the feature um if you want to get it check out our snapshot it's our small business snapshot on our website and uh, you'll get all the details um simply go to get and uh, i'll put the link uh below in the video so you guys can check it out uh there's a bunch of cool stuff that we do as well to help high levelers um, on their journey uh, but if you go right over to the snapshot store you can um, you can just hit any one of these buy now buttons. It'll scroll you down to where our snapshots are, and this is that snapshot that we were talking about. It is inside this snapshot. Matter of fact, it's it's built in in any one of our um, snapshots uh, that are available here. Um, so go here. There's a demo video on each one of our snapshots. There's a full demo video here that you can watch to learn more about exactly what what the snapshot is and what it does. All right, folks. Thanks. Take care.